Okay, so today we're going to try something a little bit different. I saw a post on Instagram for a really cool artist who puts everyday objects out in the sun, um, either in the morning or the afternoon when the sun's quite low in the sky, and it projects shadows, and from those shadows he makes pictures. Now sometimes they're inspired by movies or TV shows, and sometimes they're just from his imagination. So, we've got a bag full of objects, going outside in the sun, going to see what we can draw. Okay, so it's about four, half four o'clock in the afternoon. The sun is kind of up there, blinding me, and it's the perfect angle for us to use some of these objects from around the house. So I've got some of my kids' toys, I've got can opener, I've got a sketchbook, and I've got some pens, okay? Because one of the most important things about this is because it's an imagination-based activity, there's not really a whole lot of judgment going on based upon whether you have drawn it proportionally or drawn it accurately. This is more of an activity to, hey, grab some stuff, get outside in the sun where you can have a little bit of fun with these shadows and just flex that imagination. Okay, so I don't want you to watch it this week and think, okay, I'm really caught up on the fact that this should be a bit bigger or this doesn't quite look right because it doesn't matter. Okay, this week is just about getting out, practicing drawing and doing something which is a little bit different and really cool. Okay, so let's try this. Okay, so hopefully you enjoyed those two little drawings, one of a Harry Potter inspired Quidditch match and another of a guy with a bottle of or a barrel of something pouring it into some kind of lake. Um, a couple of things to keep in mind, if you are using metal objects to cast your shadows, just bear in mind they're going to be probably pretty warm when you pick them up. Um, and consider the material of the ground that you're drawing on as well. I very, very quickly learned during my first drawing that, ouch, the ground is really, really warm because it's about 40 degrees in Dubai at the minute. And yeah, that hurts. So please be careful when you're doing your drawing and I really look forward to seeing what you can put together with your shadow drawings. And I will see you next week. Take care, bye bye.